You are in the journalism room, uh, our home away from home for many students here. As you can see behind me, uh, we have students that are working on our electronic magazine. We not only have a school newspaper, which we're very proud of, you can see all the awards on the wall, but we also have an electronic online magazine that is something really different. I'm really proud of the girls. It's innovative. We like to call it cutting edge. It's uh, the way of the future in journalism. It is not just tied to school dances, uh, things about the school. It has lifestyle stories, health stories. We even have an advice columnist. It's kind of fun. It has serious stories, lighthearted stories, and allows more students to get involved in the journalistic endeavors that we have here. I think our total number of students involved in journalism is well over 70 now, which I think is terrific considering it's an elective and Sometimes you have to get up real early and come in for zero hour. We've recently gone to an elective program in English as well. That uh, involves, for juniors and seniors, taking a courses as varied as social change, feminine roles in literature, poetry. We even have a Shakespeare class, which I'm proud to say has over 100 students signed up for it this year, which I think is uh, a testament to the students' ability and desire to work hard and take on challenges. The uh, Great Books class has a lot of diversity of authors. We do. Authors ranging from Joseph Conrad and Heart of Darkness, which is always a struggle but worth it for the students because it's so full of symbolism, to something like uh, Camus' existential work, The Stranger. We work through that as well. So there's a lot of variety in the authors we cover. We do the classics, of course, like Pride and Prejudice and works like that. But I think the wide variety that's offered among authors and among the different courses is really a welcome opportunity for both juniors and seniors as they move along and get ready for college. The other thing about the English department here you should know is that we work really hard at critical and analytical writing. We have a number of students who have gone on to college, wound up being so far ahead of their peers that most of them actually opt out of the freshman English. It's, uh, I think, a, you know, a badge of honor for them and I think we're very proud of it as well. 